Ready? Ready. Yeah, sure. Ready. You've been recording already, right? I have. Okay. Okay. okay, okay. Okay. So, okay. welcome everybody to <clears throat> Kali Iske Show. Wait, don't. I got my co host. Wait, 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 don't you? Let me show you something. Hold on. Let me, let me show you. Jimmy let me tell does you something. I got, I got Jimmy, Life of Jimmy here. The one and only. One What's and up, only. Everybody? And I got over here, who is it? This mechanic genius. Good looking bastard. Jeez, wow. David Pasta. Oh my God. Oh, Hasa la Malaya. Dude, what the I was hell? not expecting that. That's an intro. This is Come way on. better hit than it, the first baby. time. Hit it, baby. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Okay, so wait, I have some ideas. Hold on. Okay. This, I have some ideas for this. Like, I think I got to stand up. Okay. Okay, sure. right? Sure. So the whole snappy thing, which Jimmy calls a snapper. Okay. But I heard from the professional in the room, Ray, that this is called a slate. Oh, right? oh shit. So to start the whole thing, Snapper I thought place. maybe you could mix it up a little bit, Jimmy. Yeah. Okay. Right? Kind of maybe a charades thing or right. I don't know, something. Am like I going to have to stand up? Utilize it. You don't have to. You can if you I'm want. I'm sitting back down. Right? I'm just <laughs> going. I'm going. <laughs> it's a solo mission, right? So it's like Cali e Skate Show, episode nine, right? Episode, okay. actually, I think episode, it's episode, episode nine. Yeah, nine. Yeah, nine. And then you could be something like. Delicious right, so it's like, like, Jurassic, Jurassic skate park. Right. You put your arms like, ah. You gotta go for the T-Rex on it. You gotta let him show it off. You could be like, you know. The Jurassic cut. We got the back Right? Or you could do like this, like, oh, I don't know. It's like, we got We got episode eight. Alien rides, right? <laughs> Fucking alien rides, and then you can be like, I love it. Shockboard systems, and this is my headgear. So I'm just in high school right now. What's going on? <laughs> well, is this a my proposal? My ground. <laughs> my ground got fucked up. This is the most intense proposal I've ever <laughs> seen. Right? This is the craziest <laughs> intro oh, bro. ever. No. Okay. no, yes. No, craziest no, no, intro no, 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 ever. Like, like, yeah, we're going to need more of these. After all that kind of drama, holy we're shit. We're going to end the intro, guys. We're going to be. Oh, the slate. I need the slate. Slate. Come on, mix it up, dude! Listen here, everybody, we're gonna episode nine here. Oh, no! Click, click, click! Yeah, 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 you can see it, right? Let the professor get 
You get the idea. It'll work out better in the future. You get some better ideas. <laughs> I know. Really? You can be like, ah, ah. That's a good one. I'm just going to sit over here and drink. Yeah. Oh my fucking, I'm just, oh, just gonna oh, chill. It's, like, it's me and Ray. <laughs> Ray, what's up? I got fucked up. <laughs> I was like, hey, you let's you and me do the show. How about that? <laughs> let's do this. <laughs> let's do the show, Ray. So, Ray, yeah. what's going on? What's going on? And Dina, yeah. Dina, Ray, you come on, sit down. I'll, I'll sit over here. Or I think I don't know where. I don't where Jimmy wants to see. Oh, it's not my thing. Yeah, no. You, I'm, I'm an intruder too. I am an intruder. It's warm in here. I don't know if we pause. I don't know if this is going to be part of the show. I don't, I don't know. Cheers. What, I know. what the what hell I... is that fancy stuff? <laughs> it's a tiki rum hurricane. What? Uh, made Say that again. <laughs> barrel aged rum. There's two rums in here. Uh, twice as strong. I mean, it's passion fruit juice and natural flavors. Jesus. Would you like to try some? Two rums. <laughs> Not just one. Two. 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 Exactly. What's better than one rum? Two. Dos. Another one. Dos romas. I don't know if that's right. <laughs> I don't either. I don't. Sp I don't speak the Spanish. <laughs> Ray speaks the Spanish. Okay. Oh, Carlos speaks the Spanish. Oh, wow. yeah. Yeah. Jimmy understands the Spanish. Jimmy. I can only hang out for so long. But... No Why? Yeah. Welcome Perfect. to the episode. We're. <laughs> 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 I'm I sweating too. Yeah. That was that was that was it's, a lot of work to beat you up. Or where am I sitting? Right there. Okay. I mean, I know I'm literally sitting here. But yeah, you were in the good spot. Sit here. Well, no, 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 no. Okay. That wasn't me. Okay. About thirty seconds ago, a couple of minutes ago, that wasn't me. <laughs> what? what happened? Yeah, what? he knows nothing. Over. He definitely knows nothing. Okay. So if you see yeah. video evidence of me in that, was not. Me. Okay. <laughs> okay. I clearly saw you huh. fucking him up with us. Do we like that? You think? You can do this to me? Huh? In my own house? I put cages <laughs> with all you motherfuckers! Carlos. You know me playing basketball on Pelican Bay! <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a great intro to the show, wasn't it, everybody? I what mean, the hell did we even I mean, come here for? I mean, Carlos, it just happened. Okay, so, I yeah. felt some anger. Okay, and you know, let me address the elephant in the room. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> staring right at Jimmy. Who <laughs> planned this shit? <laughs> I did. <laughs> so, so Dina, Dina actually, she kind of gave me the idea, because she was like, oh, of course, she was violence like, towards me. <laughs> Obviously, I was like, yeah. we should totally surprise Carlos. She was like, yeah, I'm gonna come in there and just and just punch him. <laughs> I was like. Yeah, we should definitely beat him up. I was like, that sounds like a better plan. <laughs> so I was like, I, 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 and then he was like, wait, maybe we should use pool noodles and not actually beat him up. So you should be thankful. Yeah. See? She had him. Thank God. <laughs> Anything that is violence, I got pictures. I got evidence. Everything that is violence towards me. We have like three She's cameras. evil. She really, is three evil. cameras watching this right now. <laughs> this you? was a poorly executed crime, but... <laughs> <laughs> she came moment. in all black. Yeah. All black, she came in all black, up. masked up, everything. I was like, holy shit. <laughs> yeah. I actually didn't know that so it was actually her at But I gotta say, I was still a little scared. <laughs> yeah. I'm not gonna lie. So he was like, see, I was telling David, because I'm trying to inform David without saying shit to you. Carlos mm -hmm. doesn't leave. He's been in the studio the whole time. Like, where the fuck are you going, dude? Like, what are you doing? So. <laughs> yeah. Like, it was, it was like four or five times, like, he's like, he was kind of catching on to it, right? And then I'm like trying to tell David. David's like, wait, who is that? I was like, no, I, dude, I'm just showing you a picture from like, Z-Skate. No, whenever, whenever, like, whenever, whenever I saw you guys, and I was like, there's something. I was like, there's something going on. Like, <laughs> dude, that was so much better than I thought. <sighs> so, God damn. why do you have to leave her? Oh, I just got to get back to some stuff that I was working on. Um, yeah. What stuff? Work. Work stuff, yeah. You don't have to go to work. 
Okay. Now the East Gate show is going to pay you from now on. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> no, Thank you, know, you, Dina, for you know coming to my house and fucking me up. Yeah. Anytime. Yeah, I know you take so much pride. You know, joy. Dude, plus joy. there's some collateral damage. I mean, look at your I know, nice she carpet. Oh, we fucked the carpet up. Yeah. Bad. Yeah. It's Bad. Crazy. But that's okay. It goes back together easy. <laughs> yeah. 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 Only uh, you guys are gonna leave me with that shit. I know, I know, I know you motherfuckers are going I know, I got some pick up my shit and go. I, I, talk I, I, to yeah. when I tried to wear shoes on the same. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, oh my god, that was so good. You actually working? Uh, yeah, yeah. She's yeah. actually working. Later. She's gonna go back later. Yeah, she's got a couple <laughs> minutes here. Yeah. So okay. So good. What, what did I interrupt? What no, was, uh, well, we came nothing. here to really kind of talk about. Eastgate Con, what what we did the last few weeks and stuff like that. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. We got David here. Yeah, you we know. got David. <laughs> David is coming in with some I'm new just stuff. A, I'm just we a got passenger. shockboard systems. Yeah. We got sure. new stuff. We got old stuff. Yeah. Tell me, tell me, tell me a little bit about this uh, new stuff that you have incoming. <sighs> <laughs> I know after that beat up, you know, it must be hard to like just look at me. Just, just no. you know, like what? all this figure. You he's know. All, yeah, he's all black and blue. Oh, no, you, all you, sad. You're still so pretty. Good God, Carlos. I, I would cry for him, but you know, then again. He doesn't. Know. <laughs> Carlos is fine. He's rugged. <laughs> Yeah. This not, might not be the last time this happens. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was worried about it because this man is in the military. Dude, like, no, no. Be so breaking into his house. I was actually worried that he was going to get an alarm opening the door. Yeah, so I yeah. was like, oh, I'm going to open the door. And he's going to have some notification that's going to go off on his watch. And, yeah, and he's like, right. I, yeah. saw, I started getting, getting it on the fucking watch. Yeah. Oh. I got cameras all the way from the front. Yeah. The fucking, like, <laughs> exactly. <camera. laughs> exactly. So I was like, whenever like, I saw his face and I started like, it started vibrating. Like, I was like, when I heard the door, I was like, okay, there's somebody there. <laughs> like, it's, like, <laughs> it's like he was aware. Okay, okay. Oh, where They vibrate different as well. Mm -hmm. So it's like, that's... They get close, like I it's, know. It's, it's, yeah. yeah, not your normal vibrators, huh? Yeah. No. <laughs> Those ones put them in the bag. Put them in the bag over there. <laughs> oh, you use it in the back? Yeah, over yeah, there? in the bag, yeah. Or down there? Because you want to feel something different. Oh, yeah. 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 This you don't do that? Topic. You don't do that? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My yeah. bad. This is this is not the journey I thought I was going to be on. I did not. I did not anticipate this detour. Wow. <laughs> this is great. I just want to. I'm just an audience member right now. He's a participant. This is awesome. In the craziness, right? <laughs> and now, God, we guys should have a live audience. That's a great idea. Right? I got. We, we may buy them. Their garage. I want to be in We may have room. some rats. <laughs> then on the other side, <laughs> cheering but them. they kind of like look for under. Let me clarify: know. some human audience members. Oh, yeah. Okay. No. Yeah, we'll set right. up some bleachers in the background. <laughs> right. You know, right. Yeah. Yeah. That would be I mean, who would come like, that's a good, there, but Who but would come by and watch this show? I would fucking come by and watch right? this show. I'm gonna charge. Yeah. I'm gonna charge them. I you would watch, not you come by and watch this show. Fifty bucks. I don't know if you're that good. Yet. I mean, I'm just saying. Just saying. Wait, what would you say? No, I'm just saying. Yeah, I know, right? I'll try I mean, everybody 50 bucks. We'll, Jimmy, give me 50 bucks. We'll take some humility. <laughs> we'll take some humility around here. It's not like every episode is always perfect, but you know, it's a work in progress. If you guys the, already had the hey, perfect one, right? If you the lights go wild, we might give them up, you know, 10% discount. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm just saying. I think we oh, what's it. happening? <laughs> what's happening, Ray? At some point. I know these fucking lights are going to go out. They're going to flash. <laughs> some, some crazy's going to happen. Not tonight. If you say that, you say that. <laughs> I've seen every yeah, right? episode and something. <laughs> Baby doesn't something trust else. you. <laughs> At that point, I accept it all. <laughs> right. Dude, if the lights go out, I'm going to be laughing. Okay, so, so chalkboards, okay? All right. What's yes. new? What's new with chalkboards? Tell me. What's new? Okay, with let me, first of all, I think I will take this opportunity if it's okay with you guys, even if it's not okay with you guys, um, to preface the situation with our company regarding the first run of inventory because uh, we have a lot of people that are very excited about stuff um, when it does become available <clears throat> and all the people that uh, did engage the process for pre-orders did get the pre-orders are going to be the first to get them. Right. 
So as a message to you guys, and I don't know when you're going to air this, so maybe there's going to be this temporal thing where it's not going to make a lot of sense when it does finally air, but um, we are working really hard to get that happening. So right. uh, we are experiencing some delays. We're having to reconfigure some stuff, and it's uh, it's just there's a lot of heavy lifting, and I know people know this, but... There's a lot of other details involved with starting a business and a component and making sure that you have the financial uh, c capacity and ability to do what you need to do to make available the product for a reasonable price. So right. that is the holdup, so to speak. But we're moving forward incrementally. We're going to make it happen as soon as we can. We're projecting late summer, but I'm not going to make promises that. But as soon as we have it, the pre-order folks are going to be the first to know and everybody else will know. So I just want to say that because even though we're doing or I'm doing some new prototyping with the mountain board thing, which you mm -hmm. which you had a little episode teaser about, um, that is not a process which is delaying the actual inventory for the stuff that's already proven. So I just want to say that it's not as right. if new projects we're are putting, holding up old yeah, we're putting resources into that and ignoring mm -hmm. the resources for the final inventory and the trick stick and the long board format which is uh actually going through some refinement but it's only going through some refinement because we have the time right now to do it because we haven't done our first mass production on those components some of which i have here so i can example some of the refinements and differences one of them being it's going to be a wider stance it's going to go from 14 from wheel to wheel on the axle width to 16, so a little bit wider for more stability. We don't plan on going any wider than that. So I don't know, Ray, if I can approach your camera. If it's going uh, to make you sense. Got the Osmo right here. Okay, how about this? Should yeah. I do this? Either or, I could zoom in pretty close. Okay, yeah. just a little bit like this. Mm -hmm. So just to example, this is, <laughs> this is what we've been testing. This is essentially the same thing, but you can just see in this particular component, which is the truck center where the shock box name comes from, because it's the box on all the Dude, we need some glitter. <laughs> yeah, come on, you guys put it in there later. Spin fingers, do some come on, kind everybody. Of CGI. <laughs> it's not us sparkling, it's a shock system. Yes. <laughs> yeah, so, <laughs> Jesus, I should have just kept my mouth fucking shut. Anyway, so. Yeah, you can see, obviously, the center component's wider. The truck wings, which are the components that go through the radial motion on either side, are going to be a little wider, so you can see. And there's some other little mm -hmm. refinements. I don't need to get into the details, but I just wanted to example that. Mm -hmm. That's what we got going on. And again, just to reiterate, the process of going through the first stages of prototyping the mountain board platform has not delaying or slowing down the process of this Definitely. moving forward for sales in the first inventory run. It's just, I do have time to do it and blah, blah, blah. So yeah. next to this, we have, or I brought the front truck. Um, I say front truck, obviously, because most platforms are going to just be a two-wheel drive motor system, right? This isn't four-wheel drive. So we have free wheel here, just spinning free wheel. There's no motor mounts or anything. So this would be the front truck assembly on a mountain board. Right. And you can see... I have it all attached here, and then this is the longboard format. So you have the truck center, and there's just a, a much different configuration regarding the pivot and how it couples and how the geometry is going to actually work for the turning and, turning and steering input with the board, of course, because you've got the upturned nose and tail and right. the mountain board platform. Is my mic working right? Because last time I was doing this, <laughs> it was like I was talking... <laughs> so well, one thing that so I chill. noticed right anyway, away with looking oh, at it here's from the pivot. looking at it from this way, I mean, a pivot, Jimmy. You could just <laughs> Jimmy taste it. It's delicious. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. sorry, it looks a lot thicker on the metal. Plus, they're flavored this time. <laughs> right? I, I, I'll tell you this: <laughs> when they were like <laughs> Dude, totally. that improvement that you did, uh, making it like wider. Yeah. What? The board <laughs> looks so badass because it, it does. Hey, bigger. look at we have yeah. an assembly right here. Oh the yeah, that's a one, right? I brought this so we could actually yeah, you could actually see it front and rear. The so rear, let's, let's, yeah, the rear also whoa. is gonna here. I'm gonna pick you it can up. Right, maybe we can get this. I'm gonna pick it up and I'm gonna approach Ray. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna approach yeah. Ray with this thing. There we go. 
<laughs> Sorry. <dude. laughs> We're gonna do some repetitions. <sighs> okay. <sighs> no. oh. So, so. Cali Eastgate workout. I don't know where I should. <laughs> you can see the front. It's a little bit scuffed up because I've been testing it. Um, blah blah blah. You mean you it's take got yours the off That hasn't changed. Yeah. And then, <laughs> and then here's the rear. You can see the motor sit a little bit higher. We have different motor guard configuration, and we have a different gear cover configuration, which isn't the snap on anymore. It actually screws on, so uh, that's going to be totally stout and stay put. One thing you can't see in the example here, but um, I will mention is that when these final go out, these finally go out for first sales, you're gonna have the uh, motor mount plate do the tensioning of the belt. So you won't actually have to tension the belt with the motor sliding on the motor mount. The whole motor mount will move and then there is an M8 screw constraining it here. So you don't have to actually take your wheel off take the gear cover off or do any of that to adjust the screws to tension the belt with the motor directly. You do it with a screw here. So it's much easier to access and do like on the fly. If you have to, if you have to tighten it or do anything, it's just basically inside. Uh, if that makes any sense, it's pretty cool. I want to, I think it's going to be a much more user friendly that one thing for a second, <clears throat> just so people can see. Oh yeah. Like yeah. how wide we go. let's, let's do the rear. Yeah. Just do the high knees first. Yeah. Mine, mine's a little bit dirtier. But, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, it's oh dirtier. yeah. You can see how much <laughs> wider oh, it is. Oh, yeah. You know, this is the old. Yeah. Scale? Say what again? Oh, I got my kidneys. Foot? For, wait, what? Scale. Scale? Like a scale scale? For scale. <laughs> no. wait, wait, what? It's just a It's just wider. Foot? We can, not, we can oh, feel yeah, my I can do, we can do this small. nose to nose, but I don't know if they can. So do this. And then yeah, pick it up. really bad. There you go. Let's do a kiss. There you can see. So it's two inches wider. So 14, the, these ver the version that will go out to, yeah. to consumers will be 16, so wider. So you're saying yeah. bigger is better. Bigger is better. Obviously. <laughs> Right, Carlos? <laughs> Sorry, I forgot we're doing filming. I'm just like... You know what? Actually, let's do riding. Something that I would like to show is the, the shred lights. The oh, shred yeah, lights check out the shred lights. <laughs> are actually pretty... Yeah, are pretty awesome that, that we have set up on this board right here. Yeah, we well, you took a cool-ass picture with the lights on, and I did charge them. How do you turn these on, guys? I don't remember. Just hold uh, the button. Yeah. Hold the button. So I mounted them here because um, the way the configuration is with the shock box... And the trick stick, there are some constraints with attaching the, what is, what does uh, Eric call them? The mounting bracket. He doesn't call them brackets anymore. Yeah. Mounting plates. With the mounting plates, I think that's what he, how he defines the mounting plate for the light here. The you could do it under the trick stick, but, you know, and you could obviously go under there, but then we just get our light bouncing off the motor. So I decided mm -hmm. to mount them on the deck. It's working out pretty good. This is the Meepo Hurricane Bamboo. And, uh. That turned out pretty good. Yeah. It's really cool at night because oh, it gives I, you, I love, I love you it. can actually yeah. have a line of sight for someone behind you to see it so they know they're right behind a rider visually. Mm -hmm. But it also does give this really cool ambient glow to the motors that makes it look like a oh, fucking, yeah. I don't know, red rocket yeah. taking off. Yeah. But then in the front, there's no issue. I just mounted these ones under here. Dude, I bought another one of these. Oh, you bought it? Um, the SL1000. Yeah, sure. Oh, yeah. Shout out to Shred Lights. Like, you know, shout out to Shred Lights. Am I turning it on? Sponsor. Uh, do you there it goes. There we go. One, two, we call those three, the, the pocket suns. Mm. Pocket suns? Because they're three, blinding. Four. Dude, look how cool <laughs> Like looking at the sun. It's pretty cool. Anyway, whatever. Yeah. <clears throat> Shred Lights. No, but uh, uh, I think uh, we'll be working on uh, pretty much like a, well, how they call it? Like a... Uh, Dude, that's cool. Uh, kind of like a mm -hmm. mount for... For them, right? I did have a preliminary discussion with Eric many, many months ago about that, but I have a lot on my plate right now, so I'm not going to do it. Uh, so yeah, no, eventually, eventually, that's it what would I'm be saying, really like, cool to have something that actually attaches directly to the yeah. front plate, maybe of the trick stick. It totally can be done. I just have not been working on that. Yeah. yeah. No, eventually. So eventually, we'll I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. It's, yeah it's, it's a, it has been thought. It's... I know, dude. It's out there. I need a, <laughs> I need a team. That's my problem. <laughs> I can't afford a team. You need three of you. 
Yeah, bro. No. Do you want me to put this back, Jamie? Yeah. I got you. <laughs> Shackboards. <laughs> <laughs> shackboards, whole new meaning to shackboards. Right. Yeah, right. No, but I love, I love the fact that you made it wider. What what makes you like go for well, I wider? mean obviously Just having the looks. a wider platform. No, no. <laughs> no. The functionality of having a wider stance is stability. Okay. That's really the bottom line. Okay, nice. I mean, I haven't put it through laboratory testing to see like <laughs> what do you mean? What the actual assessment is in a controlled environment of one, you know, width versus the other, but it's kind of a no-brainer, a little bit wider, a little bit more stable. Right. But nice. yeah, I wanted okay. to do it now. There are a few other things that give me an advantage for the configurations of the mechanical components with inside the assembly regarding springs and how they're constrained, but I'm not even going to get into that because it's not worth it. Most people would just be like, whatever. <laughs> why this cool? So why this cool? Actually, I'm not going to go any wider though. I know some companies, especially the bigger mountain board companies, are doing super ass wide trucks. But yeah, I just don't. I don't see me ever doing that. Are you okay? Fuck, it's inside. It's a rocket. Oh shit! It's the night. It's the like, nitrogen are you, are you rocket. You trying to take advantage of me? No. You put a bail here? Oh, there's like, something in there. No. no. <laughs> oh, Carlos. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. <laughs> No. I'm, I'm drinking mine right now, don't worry. <laughs> oh, and take advantage of I'm just going to hurry up and get finish mine. He would. <laughs> right, just make sure you finish all of that. There's drugs in That's these? all. <laughs> it's just like... I'll do more. Go, 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 go. go. <laughs> oh. No, but I, I, I like what you did there. Because, um, like, it, it is... Um, like anything that gives you a little bit more like stability, yeah. Like out there, because I know like last time we went uh, trail riding, um, there was uh, one of our, one of the guys that went with us. Uh, he was saying like uh, he had gone trail riding before, but like what we did was something else. On a else. whole other level, it was Absolutely. different, and that's what like it got me thinking like the. What they're thinking, what people think is of roading on a board, it is not what we're doing. Like we're we're going like to actual like biking kind of like. Yeah, I'd say most of the time people's idea of all terrain boards in the environment of a fair. trail is either something that's very groomed or something that's very maintained. Right, and that's fine, obviously. With the wheels and the and the systems that are out there that don't have suspension, that really. It's technically all terrain, right? Mm -hmm. you're, you're off the pavement. But again, my inspiration for this whole thing is real off-roading, meaning that you're going to be on single track, you're going to be on really rocky stuff, sometimes rock gardens, stuff that's very rutted, stuff that's not maintained to any yeah. real extent. I mean, mm -hmm. that's what I really wanted for my board. I would love to like, kind of like <clears throat> take these videos, right, from these other mountain boards and put it side by side with what we're doing. See what I'm saying? Yeah, comparative analysis. Whenever yeah, you yeah. compare it, you're gonna be like, okay, this is not the same thing at all. You know, like this is like pro, like, and it's crazy because like I would love to see races on that. Oh my god, maybe that'd be, <laughs> we'd we'd absolutely. Talk about it. I know that uh, Dina would yeah. be all up. Oh all yeah, over absolutely. That. I, yeah. You know, I, I felt the difference too. You said like having a difference between the oh all terrain capable, like oh it has some off roading tires on it versus it has suspension. Because I have an own board, Bamboo mm -hmm. Zeus. It's normal setup, the stock kind of version, basically. And then I tried Alex's with the shock board system. Mm -hmm. Different world. Like, yeah. it's a different board entirely. It's just yeah. it's great. Like, yeah, yeah, it's much more well-behaved yeah. on that yeah. on actual off-roading terrain. And yeah. going up, I, I keep stressing this, going uphill. <laughs> going uphill with this, like, it's, it's, like not, it's like snowboarding, like, up a hill. You don't go it's, up. You normally go down. Yeah. yeah. So it's, <laughs> it's like, like, we're doing it's like whatever. Way. If you try a regular, I don't know, mountain board or long board that is, you know, uh, all terrain or whatever, and you try to go up these hills with like rocks all over, like they won't get the traction that they need. And due to the fact that this is like all wheels are independent because of the suspension, like it has more traction. Yeah. So you can easily go from the bottom to the top nonstop, you know, if you keep your balance. 
you know? Yeah, it's much more well-behaved. I mean, yeah. that's the whole point. And it's yeah. proven. I mean, any independently sprung suspension system or sprung suspension system is a, a definite advantage when you talk about unpredictable and crazy terrain. Right. It's not flat. It's not a road. It's a paved road. That's the target. Are you okay, Jimmy? Because you're uh, yeah, right. a little bit like... That camera. Staring at something out there. I'm trying to get Ray's attention silently. In the middle distance. <laughs> I'm giving that, that evil eye like, Ray, look at me. <laughs> we're losing Jimmy. It's like, hey, it's like, hey, continue, guys, sing continue. Sing guys, don't worry. We're just you know, trying to add some more yes. production value to this. Carlos, those are valid points. I love hearing you just be very concise about yeah. the whole thing because I Come know on. I tend to be a little bit wordy. But yeah, yeah. it is... Um, it's just fun. It's yeah, fucking it cool. It's fun. I mean, I have yeah, to yeah. say, you can definitely, you can off-road with all terrain boards without suspension. It's you can. Just, it's, it's much more difficult and it's let you much less successful yes. in certain environments. And like you yeah. said, you, you could, if you're a really good rider, you mm -hmm. might be able to manage some yeah. of the hills like, in a, in a comparative sense, but you're not, you're not going to have as much success but that's statistically. What's you're going to fail more often. That is what make it, makes it <clears> fun. Okay, because yeah, like here you manageable. are, like last time we were with a mountain board, right? Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. We, Jimmy, we Jimmy, were Jimmy. doing, we had a mountain board, right? <laughs> Which is the sign for that. And then we had another, like yeah. a long board, uh, long boards with yeah. the system on. And obviously these long boards with the system, with the shock board systems, operated by far a thousand times better. Than the mountain. Board, what was you know? better? Yeah, I don't know about a thousand times, but yes. Yeah, I no, I felt a million bro, times I was, better. Bro, so. I was ten million times I better. I used all the boards that day, bro. Like, yeah, no, it's cool. I'm, I'm the I'm the stuntman for yeah, fucking yeah. shock boards. <laughs> like, yeah, like, I feel like I am too, and on a purpose. Like, though, yeah, dude. They, they, uh, we talked David about is that like, uh, if somebody's yeah. gonna die, let it be Carlos. Like, <laughs> he's like, you know. He's playing with that anyway. He's used to stuff like that. <laughs> I mean, he's the only one that laughs when he falls down. <laughs> yeah, bro. Like, every time I fall down, like, for me, it's just like, I don't know. It kind of surprises me, but it makes it, it makes me laugh because I'm not expecting it. You know, I'm trying to, in my mind, I'm going through, you it know. It is kind of, it's, it's, it's funny. Yeah. It's funny and ridiculous. In my mind, so, I look like that. Dina on the road, but then, like, I, I don't actually make it. Through, you know, like I just, you know, and I'm like, okay, I see me now. You I know. still have to post that video of you almost falling into that mud puddle. Oh, this oh yeah. This Can I send it to you guys? Oh, yeah. Right. Can we add that in? Yeah, yeah. Well, that's a good clip. Yeah. That's a good clip. Let's take a moment for that hey, clip. One, two, three. I got some good reflexes, you know. Uh, you know. Uh, I do my thing. That was so funny. I, I didn't thing. get to see that. Uh, yeah, I no, bro. And I, I was like, you uh, were literally hopping on one foot. Like, yeah. <laughs> and right about to go in the water. No, it's like we, uh, I, I know that Dina was trying to get a video that day and I, I don't know what happened to my foot again. <laughs> Yeah, it's that's like, a fun trail. I would love to do an, an intro to trail or some kind we of. We are. The it's gonna time. happen. I on got, that trail. I think I got like we ten got people already. Right yeah, that I one. got ten we people got already. Comments. I'm trying to get five more. If I get five, we're doing it. Yeah, five is plenty. I wish yeah, I, I wish I had like more it would be fifteen at that point. You know, yeah. so it's gonna be wild. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be wild. <laughs> yeah, it's, intro, it's fucking fun. In, intro to trail. Yeah, Bring your trail. gear. And you heard it here first. Helmets required. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> and back to your point, um, you were touching a little bit on the possibility in the future. And I think this is going to be a reality. Mm -hmm. And I know, Dina, you were talking about it too before something crazy happened. I don't remember what. But mm -hmm. <laughs> the, this is how I see it. I, I see the evolution of events and things going. Obviously, the track component, like Stooge Race Sports, that's always going to be a thing. That's freaking awesome. Mm -hmm. But I definitely think there is going to be a much more frequent off-road type style event. It doesn't mm -hmm. have to be necessarily with dirt. A facsimile of a trail environment can be done, like the ramp I was building, something like that. And that, mm -hmm. could, be, that could be the mountain series. Yeah. Right? I mean, it doesn't have to be a mountain board. Profile and doesn't even have to be a suspension board, but just adding the third dimension of vertical features. Right. You've got jumps, you've got gaps. Maybe you do have a rock garden kind of thing like I've made. Doesn't have to be exactly what I made, but something that gives you a challenge and really introduces this unpredictable uh, type of element to right. 
the substrate, as it were, right, in that. So it's kind of like a mountain. Right. That would be cool as hell, man. Yeah. To me, that would be definitely, for me personally, that's much more, has much stronger value as a spectator yeah. sport. Like it's adding like more jumps across. and shit. Like, right, or slope uh, style or oh dirt jumping. Oh, my God, you imagine? That'd be cool I would hell. love to be able to push the other guy, like, you know, that wow. would make it more we'll fun. We'll get into like, rally ah! racing eventually. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. that'd rally be cool. Rally style, yeah. that'd be great. So bring my chain out. <laughs> The Watch. one wheels do it. The one wheels have it. Yeah. That's cool. So, so maybe like, Eastgate Con will eventually, maybe two, three years from now. That would be brilliant. They bro. could have a component. Maybe it doesn't have to be so sanctioned as an actual race event. Maybe it could just start out as sort of a, I don't know, spectator as, as thing. I sent David a video of, <clears> I think it's uh, NC, uh, the, North Carolina. Uh, North Carolina's yeah. uh, Eastgate They do an event, an actual race. Doing races. Yeah. On off trail. Race. It's really? pretty cool. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, East Skate off trail. East Skate? Yeah, it's East Skate. Yeah. Okay. That's so, cool. yeah. so it like, it's like, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's fucking hey, cool. Like, we had the idea. That's the first time I see that. So like Yeah, it's an organized event. Yeah, yeah exactly. let's make it happen. You I know, think like it's great. push it, you know. It's yeah. just I see it like just on the edge. We just need to keep it a little push. I don't see why it won't <laughs> start to happen. Yeah, no, I think it would be exciting. It's kind of I don't, think, it, it's like, I don't I, think it was feasible at first, is why. That's what you know, I think. The, like, the I wouldn't the race. It was just so expensive. And it's the, like. The track would be complicated. That's what, yeah. That yeah. is what will prohibit the implementation. I know it's going to be greater cost. Mm -hmm. It's going to take a lot more effort and more yeah. cost. But you could scale it down. You could make it feasible to some extent. I mean, it's not like you have to like load the entire track or race course with features. Right. You could be very strategic about how you implement it. You know, you might even be able to share the same track and be able to pull the features out onto the track. But I know creating the features or having the features, that's going to be a huge cost. I mean, there's logistics involved with such mm -hmm. an endeavor, but at the same time, yeah. there's probably a cost-effective way to do it. And I don't think it's like what I did with wood. That's going to be... That's going to be too heavy. Maybe it's going to be meeting in a place that already has these trails. Yeah, that's, that's like, what I'm saying. Like, like, yeah. in, maybe um, like a yeah, bike, yeah. bike kind of like. That would be the yeah. idea. You know, we did the BMX, whatever, we did the BMX yeah. bike, you know, thing, yeah. the little like, that. The little, like yeah. up and down trail oh that, that was here. God, at the, I would love to try so this. There is a slope style thing that just opened in San Diego for mountain bikes. I haven't been oh. there. So that could, that could work there's out. There's one in Linda Vista right Yeah, there's got to be. Like, it's like, I don't know, five miles or something like that? That'd be cool. Something like that. Yeah, that's that's the one that we went with, uh, uh, with Kyle. Yeah, with, yeah. Uh, and it was an SD skate event with. Uh, I think it was Evolve. just an Evolve event. It was an Evolve event. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, event. I remember that. Yeah, that yeah. I mean, it was fun. Yeah. It was, it was a lot of fun. Me video. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It was pretty cool. And that was, bro. It was fun. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. you know, like it, it had jumps. Like you had to like you know. <laughs> yeah. We had, I think Hamza was actually jumping that time. He was actually yeah. like getting air. Like he was the only one that was actually doing yeah. it. Yeah, he was. That's, that was, my, that's that was the first time I saw him. I was like, nah, this this guy is. Yeah, yeah I had to get him on film. I was, I was, awesome. Don't look at him at the eye. Don't look at him at the eye. Oh, it's, just, it's crazy. Thinking Hamza is so crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Dude. That right there. Shout out to you, Hans, if you're watching. For real. Let's go, Hans. Yeah. You got some serious Ooh, talent. He, he won. Hey, uh, he first was first place in advance. Yeah. With a with a fucking with a ball broken with, board. Dude, with no, it wasn't broken. It was just it was just a fucking uh, Jerry rig together. Yeah, he used. It was literally he used tape. two yeah. batteries and four wheel drive setup with two remotes running each set of motors. He, so he was running one remote with the yeah, front motors, yeah. run reverse, by the way, because yeah. you can't run them the same way. No. So he reversed them, right. and then the back ones he's running with the other remote. <laughs> Did he use and like so, shrink wrap or something? To get that's something. <laughs> <laughs> he if you had shrink wrap to I don't know why yeah. I look surprised. Like, like, it's yeah. like, dude, it's Hamza. Oh my God. I would expect something like that I, from him. Like, totally. So I expect that from him, but to expect <laughs> that board to not only take first place against Fucking straight up race boards. Yeah. Like he was yeah. going against fucking race That's boards. That's because he's so fucking You know, for good. him to actually. He was going. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Advance. I was in advance. I'm racing nothing but it's dude's race boards. Yeah. Wow. And, and he, there he was, was maybe one other production. He was but racing his Renegade, right? Like, dude, these guys were like top of the line. <laughs> And this guy, now granted, I think there was a, a now collision gonna be, or something. There's happened. gonna be a, 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 a company that's gonna be, wait, where's, oh, let me see those two Dude. broken boards. I'm gonna put these motors on a board and you it's know, gonna be racing. I think that's an example of true talent. Like, <laughs> yeah. give me any I think it's board true you talent. got, I'll make it work. You know, yeah. I think the first year, a boosted board won, won the event, and then and then this year, Hamza won on that event. So it, it really goes to show that it doesn't matter. You can go out there with a $10,000 board. 
you know, you can also go out there with the 2000 put together board and still fucking come out on top. Yeah. That's the beauty of it. It's like, dude, look at what he won with. And that's just mad respect. It's like, that board isn't supposed to be there. You know, it's not. It's just not supposed to be there. You know, but Frank it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Frankenstein you, board. God. Dude, yeah, and just... shout out to Mike and company for coming up with a track layout that is basically going to mm-hmm. constrain it in such a way that you have to be a skilled writer. Mm-hmm. I heard Joe built it. That yeah. So that's that's an important yeah. factor, yeah. right? Yeah. He designed okay. it. Yeah. Joe. So shout yeah. out to Joe. Yeah, shout out, shout out to Joe. Good and job. everyone else who was involved right. in that. Yeah, and everybody else, so not to take away credit. Because it's super not contract. just about the most powerful board. It's about the skill of the writer, too. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it, it's a factor. You the board's a factor, it. but it's it's not the Dana heaviest factor. Dana killed it. Right. Dana, yeah, Dana, Dana killed, killed it. it. The pro yeah. class. Yeah, pro yeah. class racer over here. I was seated at the very bottom of pro class, so I was up against some pretty serious competition. Yeah. That it was, does, I don't know. Like, you can write anything. You fucking crushed it. I was on that board for a month, so I got it a month before that event, so not too much practice, but I made it work, you know? Yeah. But that's the thing. So, you know. That's the thing. Like, like all the time that I've uh, known uh, Dina, like, you can give him just, give her just one wheel at roller skate. One wheel, and she'll be on that motherfucker, like, going around, like, on one feet, like this. Like, she's crazy. Dina will be known for the person that rides anything. I'll take that. I'll take that. I like that. Wait, actually, wait a second. (laughs) (laughs) Jesus. I'll take that. I bet you will. Oh my god, she, <laughs> god damn. she jumped on that real quick. Oh, hey, you see me, I didn't say anything suck. afterward. It was all her and her perverted mind that did this all is that. Still going sideways. <laughs> hey Dina. No. But it, it, what I meant by that was like the sign. You. you put the Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Fucking got We wanna to make an official fucking got Official to delivery. No, they're not the, oh. the best flavor. No, the other one, Carlos! I know, I know. This she gets the one, best right? of there the uh, versions that are. What? I have. I have. Today we want to oh. make. Yeah. I the uh, official. For you, but I don't. An official Thank gift. You. Oh, do I need a, like, no, you, you don't. No, I'm gonna knight you. <laughs> this is Go just ahead. getting knight weird. <laughs> She's gonna be knighted a shockboard <laughs> system <laughs> rider. Oh, you, you may oh, race up. Ma'am, uh, I don't know, shockboards. Ladies lady. and gentlemen, Dino shockboards. Woo! 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 Show you. me your trick sticks. <laughs> <laughs> you got it here first. You can put them here if you want. So I'll come by tomorrow if you guys want to do a little video of putting them on the on the own board. So uh, oh, yeah. tomorrow we're well, not, not going to be. I'm not going to be able to make it, okay. but we well, can we like can the Sunday. Way. I'm going to yeah. be available if I'm available Sunday. Sunday, Sunday. Okay, let's Sunday. Yeah. Sunday? Okay, Sunday. Okay, let's Sunday. Sunday. Uh, not yeah, Sunday. So oh yeah. Again. Yeah. Hey, everybody! Shout out to Dina Racing at Phoenix for you know. Yeah. 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 How's that? Okay. So. I want to leave some of that for hers. I yes. am so excited. I just, know. Like, and, and it's not just me. I have a prototype of the Monsoon Legacy race board. It's a very rough prototype. There's like a few things that are just kind of, you know, wire sticking out. Right. It's <laughs> everyone, you know, everyone that's stepped on it, that's tried it, has been just in awe. And I'm just, I'm. that's like not me. Wow. I'm so, saying everyone who's tried it has been like, this is a game changer. That's crazy. So, wow. Next time, Not even my so, you're going to bring it because we, hey, yeah. Yeah. we're going to do a show. We're going to do a show on Dina. Yep. She's going to bring that board. We're going to talk about it. We're going to talk about the thing. I don't want you to talk about the team just yeah. yet. We're going to talk about the team and all, all right. that stuff. We that great future content plans for future and all episodes. That yeah. This isn't a one yeah. episode thing. Yeah. 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 Fingers. I'm going to leave you there because that's, that's what I do for ratings. Yeah. She wasn't even supposed to be here. <laughs> <laughs> she wasn't supposed to beat me up. <laughs> and she did. This how it happens? <laughs> God damn it. This episode's going to be one of the most bro, weirdest. Bro, women hate me, bro. And most women fun hate and me. strange and bizarre. And it's like, something just about my broadly. face. They make a woman just want to, like, you know, I want to just bash your head. You know, I'll fuck you up. And he likes it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he does. Mm-hmm.
Wow. That's what they do. a kick out of it. Wow. And they go like, I hate him, I hate him, I hate him. See, that's what I'm talking about. I hate him, I hate him, I hate him. This episode's fucking weird. Hey, I know Carlos is, but we're going to move on for a minute. The big points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, um, so, hey, uh, can I show the uh, back part of the... Uh... <laughs> Keep going? Sure. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. It's going to change. Let me just... The caveat is it's not going to stay that way. Yeah. But... It, and also, like I want to reiterate, the mountain board platform, which um, the, the rear configuration of the system, which Carlos is exampling here, this is... I just want to be extremely careful. This is like a concept vehicle. It's extremely rough. This is the first proof of concept physically of the system and there are a lot of things i still have to tweak so not that anyone's gonna fucking care what yeah. it is no what i'm I saying i'm just I'm saying the only, just i'm saying. the pilot so I, I, i'm the only one caring about that. right touch it touch it night yeah there you go, there you go. Oh, what's that, what's that uh, that's oh my a, God. what's that bendy video there which she was like I don't think anyone knows. Oh my gosh, it was uh, these motor fucking guards are just in right? dude Look at that. I swear. These are, you don't even know how long they're it thick. took me to do that. That's crazy. Uh, and it looks I nice. don't know if they're going to say that. <laughs> no, this is a beast, bro. Like, yeah, it's a uh, beast. I know we put it on uh, on the Velar. Yeah. Oh my God, that That's looks cool. sexy as it hell. It looks, looks cool. Really <laughs> sexy. Yeah. It does. It bro, does look it's pretty badass. It's a beast. Dude, it the looks Velar already looks good. God, it yeah, already looks one. crazy. Just, yeah, no, the Velar is Dude. awesome. Let and then you throw that system it. on there and it's oh, all oh, white. God. It's just like, you better stop. So that's the old yes. one. Look at the new one that I came up with. That's This is the version that everyone is testing right now. Mm -hmm. Real reactions here, guys. It's so nice and matte and polished. Yeah, so I had them do a little bit of a stronger anodizing process um, on these, and that's how they're going to be for the final consumer. Hey, but, have yeah. you talked to them about getting white? Well, <laughs> well I, it just won't get anodized. So it'll get just Bruh. be blasted, and it'll just be bare aluminum, and it could have a clear coat on it. Maybe eventually, be, I got to start agree. selling these fucking yeah, things you first, imagine, though. Say, like switching the colors of it? I yeah. would like to do a like 4th of mm -hmm. July version, maybe 2025. Dude, yeah. you know me and him. Yeah, I know. I, saw I, I still have my 4th of July outfit. Like, yeah. I'm coming out yeah, strong. Yeah, so we'll have some. I got mine, bro. I'm growing back out my hair just for yeah. that alone. <laughs> all my tactical Wait, gear for this one. Yeah, my Fourth of July outfit. You don't remember? No, I'll be like, why is it oh, your hair? What? Yeah. So I have a USA like like hairband like that goes around, and I had my hair grown out, and it was like, oh, I went. It was a dope ass outfit. I liked I, it. I went as uh, I, it was kind of like a black face. I was going like a yeah. black face. You, you ever seen Tropic Thunder? Yeah. Jesus, yeah. That's weird. Yeah. Here's the shit, bro. Jesus. Robert Downey Jr. He killed it on that. that was a great movie. He killed it. Bro. Oh my god, that movie. Is <laughs> Where are we? We're just meandering. This is awesome. So yeah. It's just like I don't know what this is. Is this really about Eastgate? I don't know yeah. what this is, but I love it. <laughs> this is fun. Circle sure back around, guys. Dude, dude. <laughs> oh wait, I had a. There was a guy dude. that had an idea. This is, was his name Carlos? My phone? <laughs> <laughs> okay, <on> my phone. <sighs> I left my phone somewhere. Oh my uh, God. So there so was somebody. It's out. in a pool noodle somewhere. Yeah, probably. I got it. I, I got know. it. I got my iPad. I got my. I, I got my iPads. We have wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. So this guy comment on one of the uh, posts about chalkboard said he had an idea. And oh, I is that on the YouTube video? Yes. Oh. Cool. Here, I got it. You got it. Yeah. The YouTube video. No, oh, one year, it's, it's on, on the, your video? It's on the last, it was the last comment as well. Let me see who gets this. On so, the one you guys right just released? There we go. Holy comment. Read it, read it That's out a loud. ginormous so, comment. I'll try my best. <laughs> <laughs> you got this, Jimmy. <laughs> Use your announcer voice. I have a suggestion. Start over. That was it. I'm joking. <laughs> no, he said uh, that might help improve the shock board system. Although it might seem a bit unconventional, uh, what if they incorporate a couple of the opposing magnets mm -hmm. within the system? The magnets <laughs> could be strictly placed so that it, when the trucks hit their full compression uh, and range of motion that they create a slight resistance. This resistance could help to dampen, dampen intensity. The system, yeah. Yes, exactly. Right, no, I get it. So That's an innovative thought. And I'm sure it could be configured in such a way. However, I will say, I did a lot of 
thinking in different iterations virtually for a dampening system. And the reason I didn't end up actually doing that after the first prototype and physical proof of concept is because it didn't seem that it would give us a strong advantage. Mm. Um, even on some seriously rough terrain, dampening is a real thing. And I wouldn't think it would be a detractor at all. So let me just preface that. If I did implement some dampening system, you would get slightly better performance value on, on the return. Um, however, it didn't seem like it would offer that much more benefit. Okay. So I've decided okay. not to do it. <sighs> it would anyway, be something so, like maybe like in the future. Yeah, like, no, you know, they're, they're, we're pushing a little yeah, bit further, you know. There are other ways to do it. That The magnet system has, I mean, it can. The issue with that is... There is a lot of force going through there. You'd have to have a ridiculously strong magnet, which could be done, but I, honestly, I don't know. I, I don't know how much effective dampening that would actually offer because you're constrained by space. That's the other yeah. thing. These, these component bodies, right, it looks like you've got a lot to play with, but honestly, if you, if you inspect it and turn it around, there, there's a lot of nesting. There's a lot of cavitation in here, so there's a lot of negative space in this. It's actually pretty light. Mm -hmm. But I kept mm -hmm. I kept the wall thicknesses um, as as substantial as I could so that we could maintain strength. Right. Um, and I, I've done a, some reduction on those things with these other components because they've proved to be pretty fucking strong. But that would be that would be an issue. Right. It's already it's I'm already fighting like keeping it at this size and scale. Right. Like that's that's definitely an issue. And, and I, that's I, I understand that because like like whenever you see it, like everything is just it's very condensed. It picks. Yeah. So. Like everything makes sense. Like once you put it, is every space has a purpose. Oh, oh absolutely. Yeah. And I could do I could implement something like that, but yes, mm -hmm. it will effectively have to change a lot of these component bodies. Yeah. And it can be done. I just, the analysis that I've seen is, it's not a huge benefit and not to belabor the point, but we want to start selling these things. So <laughs> I got to slow my roll. I think, yep. I think we're easily over 90% there with mm -hmm. having some level, I don't want to use the word perfection, but refinement that's optimized, right? Mm -hmm. I don't think any, I guess you could make an argument yeah. that nothing ever really achieves perfection except for yeah. Carlos. You all know that. Look at the studio. I mean, just look at it. Mean, look at the backdrop. Can I get the way. camera? Can I get the Do camera? Do a close up. Do a close up. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. That's nice. Yeah, the soundy things. <laughs> so, yeah, perfection. Okay. Perfection. So, that's my target right there. Yep. That's my target. This is you what I came up out. with. Hey, we've already fucked him up once. We can go out of it again. I know it's not as pretty. <laughs> Dude, are you flexing? Yeah. Oh, no, I'm it. just. Let's do, it. Let's do it. Flex off. I'm pointing at him. He's got you big time. Oh, shit. Feel it. Feel Don't it. I'm not gonna feel do it, that. Jimmy. Okay. Touch it. Touch it. Touch the touch, touch it. I don't know what I'm do touching. It. Do it. Why am I staring at Carlos when do I'm it. doing that? <laughs> <laughs> because you got you got the pretty face and then you got the, you know, my bicep. <laughs> I'm just hoping they would be on here. It's like, got damn the, it. Got, <laughs> you got the best. Of, this show is just everywhere. This show is so what the fucked fuck? up. You're gonna have to edit the shit it's out of this. Fun to watch more. This is basically just gonna be Dina beating up Carlos. Yeah. That's gonna be the episode. I think that's gonna definitely make the ad. Uh, that's awesome. Yeah. I, wanna, I yeah. wanna put a sad song in a slow motion on that. <laughs> Dude, you, oh my god, you totally have to slow mo that, Ray. You're definitely gonna have to do some slow mo stuff, maybe some editing, like throw in some Star Wars theme music oh. or something. Yeah. Like, oh, I place, oh, I purposely gosh. placed that 360 camera, knowing this is gonna happen. So that's why I purposely made sure that happened. So yes. So you guys will see the whole visual of everything of that. Oh, and in the comments, everybody, I suggested they get a sky cam, like a cable, so yeah. they can have a camera come in for close-up shots, like when Jimmy's like modeling fucking yeah. Beyond Riders mm -hmm. jackets and stuff. Perfect. So you can get like a dynamic <laughs> camera. I imagine, I imagine. So everyone should tell us if that's a good idea or a bad idea. I think it's a great idea to do the whole freaking sky I imagine sky Ray with a fucking string, like doing a thousand things at the same time, putting right. a ring. Right. So right. That one guy's like, ding, ding, oh, ding, on, ding, 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 ding. Come on, Ray. <laughs> oh my God. We are in now need of a helper. One for the, show. For, <laughs> it's like the puppet master over We're gonna there. need a, a helper over right Yeah, here. we're gonna need it's somebody like, to help Ray. Dude, hey, how long? This episode's we're going like, hey, Dina, you want a job? <laughs> right? Hey, I'm unavailable, but I'm down. <laughs> I'm, on a, I'm unavailable, but I'm down. <laughs> yeah, 
<laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> <laughs> She's not getting in trouble. Corey, don't worry. We won't get her in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't worry. I protect myself with my wife, too. You heard me on my last episode. <laughs> what is going on, man? So, okay. <laughs> Ray, what's going on? So, going back uh, to... Hmm? Right, shock boards, right? Shock boards. When is it, when, when is the, <sighs> when are we aiming to? The, the target now is late summer. I, we're really trying. I don't want to get into the weeds with all the crazy shit happening, but it is, it's, just, it's a matter of financial investment. There's a lot of heavy lifting financially. So mm -hmm. my wife and I, it's our business. We are freaking not rich people. We want to make this. I mean, I, I think you have to make it available to people at a reasonable cost, right? And mm -hmm. so the real factor of providing a reasonable cost to people is to have a mass production run mm -hmm. on the components that we need to make the assemblies. Yep. And I, I know a lot of people know that, so my apologies if I'm stating the obvious, but that's the crux. Right. That's, that's the threshold we've been talking about. The first implementation was going to be a pre-order process, but we just didn't get enough people to make that happen that's okay because i think i honestly i don't think a lot of people really knew we were even a thing so yeah, that was yeah. a, that was a that was a dice roll mm -hmm. um not risk for the people who would have gotten the pre-orders had we made that threshold mm -hmm. um but we just didn't make it so we're, we regrouped and we're moving forward and yeah. there's some things i just can't talk about right now yeah. because yeah. there's relationships yeah, that we're implementing with other parties to make this happen, but that's all I can say right now. Mm -hmm. So the projection, the earliest projection now is late summer. I wish it could be early. If we can, I will freaking be broadcasting that and we'll be we'll be yeah. making we'll send out notifications we'll to people. We'll make sign another up. show. Yeah, yeah, we can do another we'll show. Bring it back on. And so I'm coming back in August too, and then we can do a little bit more because I'll have some refinement and probably have some updated news in a couple months. You know, not, not, not too bad. Yeah, we'll be back. Not too bad. So, We'll probably have another three more systems. Yeah, plus... <laughs> the new, the dude, David doesn't stop. He, I, he's always Iron working. Man, Iron Again, Man. Was, yeah, dude. I stopped. We just had some downtime, right? So I was making some refinements, because I could. But that didn't slow down the process. I just want to be yeah. very clear about that, mm. right? No. It hasn't delayed any potential for our first inventory run. There was just an opportunity I took advantage of. I was of. actually hoping you were relaxing. You know, honestly. I wasn't relaxing. Because just so you know, I mean, this is a business venture, right? But... Freaking, there's still careers and stuff going on, right? Yep. I mean, I have a project, a construction project I have to finish when I get back to Colorado. And I'm hoping that'll be my last one because I want to make this, I want to make this work. Yep. Because it'll Bro, be Bro, that would be dream, dream job, right? Yeah. Working it'll on be, these case for the rest of your life. Uh, be, I hope so. Yeah. I mean, it's not without its own, you know, stresses, but yep. again, the target is outdoor recreation so that to that'd me be, seems like pretty fucking cool business to run that would be the only thing that i could actually leave my job because i i feel like if i be like when i retired like i can't be working on our bonds you know like it's gonna i'm no, gonna feel like what? i'm gonna be putting back <laughs> over the people's like head like this what? oh no oh this, <laughs> sorry <laughs> Jesus. doesn't sound like you're keeping that job for long <laughs> Yeah. Jesus. Yeah, what are you retiring five years from now, or what is five. it? Five. Five years. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Hopefully. Right. Uh -huh. Yeah. That's cool, man. Yeah. And you got you got you young kids have so much life to live, right? Jesus. These young kids, right? I fucking I was born That's in true. 1969, dude. Oh, you're older. Than That's me. a good year. That's a good year. The year moon landing. 69. Right? Yeah. That's a good year. I caught the last okay, something of yeah, the 60s. 69. The good thing, 69. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Did not mean it that way, Carlos. Right. Hey, you decided to be born that year. I did, not, <laughs> I did not decide to be born that year. It just happened to me, Jimmy. I don't know if you know how birth works. This makes a lot of sense. But, uh, my mom told me. But it wasn't, <laughs> it wasn't up to me. I'm just saying. As we drove by, I had I you what? over here. <laughs> Dude. <sighs> no, but yeah, I want to thank you for Some coming in again. Uh, this is the second <laughs> right. time we do the show. Yeah, like, second time. Kind of like an update, right? Yeah. yeah kinda, um, kinda like uh, I want to thank Dina for coming to my house and uh, beating me up. Thank you for yeah, that's uh, a good surprise. letting me I'll up. have my vengeance. Yeah. I'll just that's let that. you know. Okay, so, you know, just. God, I can't wait for the episode with Dina because it, it's going to be crazy, right? Yeah. 
There's I'm some. A, there's a lot right? of stuff. I'm 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 looking for Benjamin. Like, it's gonna be like Gladiators or Vendetta. something. You guys, Ooh, yeah. that's a good movie. Yeah. yeah that's Wait, a great what movie? movie? What? Uh, yeah. V no, for Vendetta. Uh, oh. What is it? November. Uh, no. Remember, yeah. remember. Remember. Remember the fifth of November. The gunpowder treason and plot. I see no reason to. I see no reason why we should ever forget. <laughs> oh, so I guess you've, I guess you've seen it's, that movie. Yeah, right? at least fifteen, Jimmy. twenty times. Wow, I don't even know yeah. that. It's it's honestly one of the best movies that yeah. I've seen. It's it's, 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 it checks really a lot good. of boxes. Yeah. yeah, and like I didn't, I wasn't expecting the uh, the protagonist to be the guy. Yeah. It is like me, like the guy is like the the. <laughs> The antagonist of uh, uh, Matrix. Yeah, this is like cinema. He's ugly as, well. as fuck, bro. That's why he's wearing a mask, bro. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anyway, sorry. Right. We're doing our review on movies tonight. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> episode three. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you, thank you, uh, David, for coming. Thank in. you, yeah. guys. You guys uh, are my us friends. That update. Uh, thank you, Dina, awesome. for okay. showing yeah, up. Friends. We're doing a show on you. Yeah, specifically Absolutely. with her. Yeah, nice. with her. We yeah. uh, there's some really. Crazy good news uh, that I'm dying to hear and for you guys to know. Yeah, and then uh, yeah, too. thank you, uh, Jimmy, for being my wingman. Yeah, always, always. Yeah, yeah right. it's, it's definitely a pleasure being here. It's, it's yeah. always a good, a good time. That has been another <laughs> lovely night in Cali East Cape Show Extreme in pleasure. San Diego. Woohoo! Peace Woo out. <laughs> uh, wow. <laughs> <laughs>